Days of Our Lives say that Dr. Rolf, known throughout Salem for his bizarre and often dangerous experiments, has stumbled upon a groundbreaking innovation, a serum with regenerative properties that could heal any damage in the human body, including the most devastating injuries. Kristen, ever the opportunist, realizes the potential power of Dr. Rolf's creation. When she inquires if this serum could even heal spinal cord injuries, Dr. Rolf suggests that with a bit of tweaking, it might just work. This opens a window of hope for Kristen, as she sees a way to use this medical breakthrough as leverage. Without wasting any time, she rushes to Xander's office, eager to make an offer that he can't possibly refuse. Xander Kuriakis, desperate to find a way to help Sarah Horton, is stunned when Kristen presents him with the serum. For months, Sarah has been struggling, confined to a wheelchair, seemingly with no hope of ever walking again. The idea that this serum could restore Sarah's mobility fills Xander with an overwhelming sense of hope and joy. But this is Kristen Demera, and nothing comes without a price. With a glint in her eye, Kristen drops a bombshell, She's willing to give Xander the serum to help Sarah, but in return, she wants a favor. She demands that Xander help free Brady Black. Kristen, still deeply entangled in her obsession with Brady, sees this as her opportunity to win him back, even if it means manipulating Xander and Sarah in the process. The dual spoilers for the week of October 7th reveal a tense moment when Xander finally tells Sarah about Kristen's offer. Initially, Sarah is stunned. Could this serum truly be the miracle she's been waiting for? Could Dr. Rolf's strange concoction really give her the ability to walk again? But Sarah's hopes are quickly dashed when she realizes that Dr. Rolf himself would be performing the procedure. Sarah knows Dr. Rolf's reputation all too well. His history of playing God and creating untested, dangerous drugs terrifies her. She's watched too many people suffer after falling victim to his bizarre experiments, and she's not willing to risk her life for a chance at something that might not even work. She repeatedly tells Xander that she has accepted her situation, begging him to let go of the dream of a miracle cure. But Xander is relentless, he's so consumed by the idea of helping her that he can't see the danger right in front of him. In one heartbreaking scene, Sarah is seen sitting alone in her wheelchair, sobbing, overwhelmed by the pressure to make an impossible choice. On one hand, she's terrified of the unknown, and the thought of Dr. Rolf's serum fills her with dread. But on the other hand, Xander's desperation to see her walk again weighs heavily on her. Can she really deny him the chance to help, even if it means risking everything? Xander, on the other hand, is determined to convince Sarah to take the risk. Is it worth it? He pleads with her, his voice filled with emotion. But the more he pushes, the more Sarah retreats, her fear and anxiety mounting with each passing moment. Meanwhile, Kristen's plan to free Brady is on the verge of collapse. Just as Xander is about to make a move, E.J. Demera steps in to block Sarah's attempt to withdraw her statement against Brady. E.J., ever the master manipulator, has finally maneuvered Brady into a position of vulnerability, and he's not about to let him go. With Brady under his thumb, EJ has the upper hand, and he's determined to use it to his full advantage. This move enrages Xander, who realizes that without Sarah's statement, there's no way to fulfill Kristen's demand. What follows is a fierce confrontation between Xander and EJ, with tempers flaring and fists flying. Xander, driven by his desire to save Sarah and fulfill his part of the bargain, won't back down. But E.J. is equally determined to keep his grip on Brady. The tension between these two powerhouses is palpable, and their clash will undoubtedly have far-reaching consequences for everyone involved. As the week unfolds, dual fans will be left on the edge of their seats, wondering what Xander will do next. Will he find a way to get his hands on the serum and help Sarah, or will he be forced to abandon his plans in the face of E.J.'s interference? And more importantly, will Sarah dare to put her trust in Dr. Rolf's serum, risking her health and her future for a chance at walking again?